Then in last year's State of the Union address, I asked Congress to pass a law that tells one million students they won't have to pay more than 10 percent of their income towards student loans. And we won that fight, too. And that law will take effect by the time that time that law is scheduled to take effect by the time freshmen graduate. But we decided, let's see if we can do a little bit more. So today, I'm here to announce that we're going to speed things up. We're going to make we're going to make these changes work for students who are in college right now. We're going to put them into effect not three years from now, not two years from now. We're going to put them into effect next year. Because of this change, about 1.6 million Americans could see their payments go down by hundreds of dollars a month. And that includes some of the students who are here today. What we're also going to do is we're going to take steps to consolidate student loans so that instead of paying multiple payments to multiple lenders every month, and, and let me tell you, I remember this. I remember writing like five different checks to five different loan agencies, and if you lost one that month, you, you couldn't get all the bills together, and you missed a payment, and then suddenly you were paying a penalty. We're going to make it easier for you to have one payment a month at a better interest rate. And this won't cost, it won't cost taxpayers a dime, but it will save you money and it will save you time.